Bay now. The Alameda County Sheriff's Office is facing a lawsuit over a protest over the death of George Floyd. Demonstrators saying deputies used unlawful tactics, things like tear gas and flashbang grenades. The class action lawsuit is demanding the office change its crowd control measures and uses. Kwan Forrest Gail Ong has details. It was late May of 2020 when demonstrators took to the streets of downtown Oakland, sparked by the death of George Floyd. Almost two years later, a lawsuit filed against the Alameda County Sheriff's Office. Emily Rose Johns is one of the lawyers on this case. Alameda County Sheriff's Department shot tear gas and projectiles indiscriminately into a crowd of largely peaceful protesters on Broadway uh, right uh, near 7th Street. The plaintiffs, including the anti-police terror project and several protesters, are seeking unspecified damages and reforms when it comes to law enforcement's crowd control measures and uses. What we're seeking to prove, what we believe the, um, that we can prove Alameda County Sheriff's Department did was that they uh, retaliated against individuals for their protected First Amendment activity by tear gassing them and using projectiles to disperse largely peaceful crowds. They used excessive force, force that is unconstitutional against people who were not posing any threat to the officers. Um, and then we have also alleged certain state analogs to those federal, uh, com uh, those federal claims, uh, including a violation of the Bain Act, which is California civil rights statute. The lawsuit was filed on April 28th. The county council could not be reached for comment. Gail Ong, Cron 4 News.